Uh, hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So this is not the video I generally do, and after a long time, I'm showing my face on camera. So uh, I've been planning it for a long time, this sort of video, but couldn't do it until now. And also, I'm not a professional music producer. I just make music as a side hobby. I like it. I've watched other producers on YouTube such as Simon Servida, Kyle Beats, Ocean and Ed Talenti, like these are some of the producers I watch and I learned from them on YouTube, that's all I've ever learned from so if I did anything wrong, when professionals are watching I'm really sorry, so yeah I'm not going to waste any more of your time let's start without any further ado Okay, so here we go guys, I have this software, uh, its name is LMMS, uh, it's free open source software, you can find it online, so I'm just gonna go and make a beat, I have quite a couple of sounds, I have a lot of cinematic sounds, I'm, so I'm just gonna go to the uh, Apex one shot so yeah I have the uh, two sounds one is uh, cymatics harpsichord and one is the cymatics witch flute Okay, so this is the melody, like chord. I just to give it that little bit of little candy of sort. Now let's hear it. Okay, so let's see how it sounds.
So yeah. I'm gonna do it four times. I'm just curious what if I reverse it. Now the thing is that I realized that it was starting like all of a sudden. doesn't need a lot of impact, but it needs a uh, transition into the action beat. I'm going to keep the velocity low because, as I said, it doesn't need a huge impact. Like if you are in FL Studio, you can just use the slice tool, <laughs> but here you can't. <laughs> so what I'm doing here is I'm creating an echo effect, which is uh, like <laughs> echo in LMMS is not the echo in LMMS is not very good, so. Uh, creating it manually like this is a lot easier, you know? I think this works. Increase it a little bit. Let's see how it sounds. I think I want to add the box. 